Let's play a game, shall we? Hello there, and welcome to Spooky House of Jump Scares. This is actually interesting because it's not the real Spooky House of Jump Scares. It is the Doom mod, as you can tell right here. These are clearly Doom options right there. Anyway, let's check it out. Let's see just how much of a good imitation it is. It seemed to be good. Okay, not too bad. And this is my home. Can you, humble player, make it through a thousand rooms? Can you find what lies at the end? Or is there even an end? Because I, I don't really know. Anyway, just, just go. Okay. Will do, if my monitor would just quit blocking out. Nice reflection, by the way. Pretty cool. Nice fade-out effect. Unfortunately, the effect is a little bit lost because it's in widescreen, but whatever, who cares? Yep. Yet further evidence that this is a Doom mod. You can <laughs> sort of see the sky box of Doom on a cube. That's kind of interesting, isn't it? Ooh, okay. It loves pointing out this is a Doom mod. Cool. Quite cool. Nice effects, by the way. Oh, you can actually see it on the map. It's got the heads-up display. It's got the auto map still there. <laughs> kind of funny. Actually, you can also do this. Look at that. It's like you're playing as Doom Guy through this whole crap. Doom's, Doom Guy's like, uh, I didn't get paid enough for this crap. <laughs> Funny stuff. Funny stuff. What's this? Oh, okay. One way forward only. Or is there? Okay, just a heart. Oh, I was about to say. Can you actually save? Spooky house. No, wait. Spoopy house. <laughs> because skeletons. If there are revenants around, it would be spoopy. No, wait. Spoopy is when there isn't skeletons. <laughs> I don't know that terminology very well. Wow, it's literally right there. Why do I hear footsteps? Is... Oh, those are mine. Should have realized that. For some reason, I thought they were independent of my walking. Nope! Completely not the case. Those are my footsteps right there. Good imitation, too. So far, it's pretty much spot on with Spooky House, Spooky House of Jump Scares, the original game. The only difference is, like I said, because I chose to do it in widescreen. That way, I would have full 720p, and I like doing that. I like it that way. Oh, well. If it breaks the effects a little, who really cares, anyway? Oh, great, it's this one. Okay, so first is left. Not up. Left. Is it left again? Okay, left, left. 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 Right? Nope, left, 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 I guess. Left. 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 You can actually sort of tell it teleports you because it just skips a little bit. Okay. Left. <laughs> Left. Left. Right. That is right. Actually, you can just auto save it. It's like cheating, but cheating. You gotta love exploiting Doom to its fullest. I would have had to go through those again if I hadn't thought to do that. I can quick save. This is Doom. This isn't the real spooky house of jump scares. It's better. You see, I am not nearly spooky house. I'm more. Take this. My save games will allow me to do it over and over again without going over from the beginning. Locked. Locked. Let me guess, locked. Ah! Next you'll say, this door is locked. Go! Oh, finally, one that I can open. Very cool. 
Why do I keep saving over and over again? That's not a feature of the original spooky house of jump scares. And it seems pretty unnecessary given the circumstances. Locked. Hooray! Locked rooms! A plenty. I also have a heads up. I also have the auto map, so that helps with that. Hmm. Let me see. Ah. I see your point. This is only room 15 after all. Not even close to a thousand. Cute. That's cute. Gotta love the adventure time aesthetic that Spooky House of Jump Scares has. It's clearly prevalent all over. You know, you know it's based off of Adventure Time. It's got the same faces. Hell, the... The ghost... The ghost woman at the beginning... Spooky, I think, is her name. She just straight up looks like a character from that show. Oh, okay. Bars. Oh, okay. This is an instance where it took me where I didn't expect it to go. It just teleported me. Cool. Very nice. Yeah, this game is pretty deceptive. It seems all innocent at first, and then it takes some dark twists. But just at the right frequency to leave you guessing, so to speak. Ah, look at that. A little catwalk up there. That's all good. That's all fine and dandy. Oh, hello. Now it is spooky because it's got a skeleton. It went from being spoopy to scoop spooky. That almost looks like the Doom Slime Pits, except the, the actual slime is obviously different. So that's cool. Oh, it's even got the greenness to it. That, that's actually pretty cool. It's not a straight up clone. It actually has some elements of Doom in it, or at least that specific room did. That's uh, ni that's a nice clever touch right there. That's a nice touch. Hello, ghost. Nobody cares. <laughs> okay, I should probably move on now. Hmm. Ooh, I wonder what's beyond here. A machine. Can I press anything on the machine? Nope. It's perfectly worthless. At least as far as I'm concerned. You're useless to me! Get out of my sight! This does go on for quite a bit, doesn't it? Hmm. More redness. It's like the color of hell. It's like I'm stuck in hell. It's like Doom Guy is stuck in limbo. Oh, uh, okay. That's a little bit more realistic than the previous ones. A little less cartoonish. Actually, for some reason, that's reminding me of the music video for Welcome to the Machine. You know, that that head that gets chopped off and then it turns into a skull. For some reason, I got that kind of vibe to it. It's got that kind of aesthetic, I think. Or maybe I just remember that video wrong. <laughs> Who knows? It could be either or, really. Don't know why it gave me that vibe, but hey, that's what it did. Oh, great. It's getting even darker. The rooms get darker and darker. And it kind of went back up, I think. Close enough. Okay, and were you going to do the same thing over and over again? Nah, this time it didn't have a curve to it. That's how you can tell it's different. It wants to be different. Okay. That's cool. Moving forward. Locked. Should have known. What the? Man, I say, am I moving forward or not? Or am I just going around in a circle somehow? Don't know how that would be possible, but hey, with this game, all things are possible. You have to expect the unexpected and all that good crap. You know, I'm definitely progressing. Locked, of course. Yep, this is new. The auto map says that it's new anyway. What the? How many of these freaking hallways are there? Would I be, would I save myself a lot of trouble by simply going through that door over there? But it keeps going on forever and ever and ever. Screw it. Forget it. Oh. It sends you back to the beginning, doesn't it? Sneaky. 
You tried to trick me, but fortunately the Doom mod can't quite rule out the auto map. So, I've got the elements on my side. Kinda. Yeesh. Okay, there's the door. There's the actual door that sent- that also sends me back. What? What the hell? So, one of those doors is the correct one. But which one? I'm not gonna go back through it over and over again. Okay, that was... That sent me back here. Okay, whatever. It's acknowledged as a new room, so we'll just say it's a new room. I guess it just randomly sends you through them until your count gets high enough. Okay, whatever. Whatever floats your boat. This game was actually pretty interesting in its original form, too. Oh. Okay, it's the other side. Yeah, I saw people playing this game. And, from what I can tell, it seems to be a pretty... pretty damn good imitation. I don't know if it's long enough to actually get to the axe yet, where you can actually start attacking things, but... It wouldn't... I wouldn't put it past it. It wouldn't be that hard, either, to pull off, because it's just a basic melee weapon. Which Doom can certainly do. Ooh, look at that. Now it's kind of looking like a Doom level. For some reason. Oh well. Oh great, you gotta choose one. Okay, I'm gonna assume I chose right. By not choosing the right one. <laughs> Literally. Oh, okay, there's that machine again, except it's in red. Hooray for that! Good for red. To be red. Oh. Let me try going through this door then. Maybe the door on the right actually was the right decision. Cute. Now you've got that more realistic skull in the cartoony goat, our cartoony slime creature. Cute. Actually, that's not cute at all. That's just weird. Huh. Yeah, everything appears to be in order, especially the limited sprint meter. Normally, I would complain about first-person shooters that have a limited sprint meter see Return to Castle Wolfenstein and Doom 3, but here it kind of fits, because it's supposed to be a sort of dreadful environment where you're just trying to survive or something. I don't know. I don't know what to make of this. You're basically just trying to get by, and it's supposed to be tense, and if you could always run, it would it might actually ruin the atmosphere a little bit. But now the rooms are repeating themselves. So that's no good. Okay. This time it's not going to be the same variable. I guess it changes some variables randomly when you teleport into them. Helps to keep them fresh to some extent. Oh, okay. When do I get to a door that I can actually use that actually gets me forward? Apparently not now. The time is not crossed yet. What the hell? Okay, there we go. That works. There's only one way forward. The illusion of choice has been stripped away from you. Most egregiously. Okay, another one of these. That's cool. Down on the little catwalk here. Am I going to get any new rooms or not? Otherwise, I'm just going to fast forward it a little bit. Because... This is no fun if it's just gonna keep repeating itself over and over again like Groundhog Day. Okay, this this looks new. I definitely don't remember a dead shotgun sergeant being there before. Definitely new. Like I said before, it's actually kinda cool that Oh, okay. Although oh, all that does is auto save it, but hey, that's cool. At first! At first this place seemed cute. But I've been here for days now. I'm feeling quite parched now, and if I keep getting this feeling like I am being watched by something... No, and I keep, not if. This is not romantic at all. This may be the opposite of romantic. Nothing kills... Nothing kills a romantic feeling, wink wink, faster than this. Down. Go down. Huh. 
That's a very disturbing elevator sound, don't you think? Okay. I'm gonna assume the death elevator is done now. Oh, okay. Good thing I've got this! Nope. Forward. Go forward again. Okay, forward again. Forward twice. Left. Luckily, I've got this. Forward twice and then to the right. <coughs> cool. To the right again. Hard to tell what it's gonna do. Left again. Nope. So, certainly not. Forward. Cool. Wait. This is kind of cheating a little bit. Yeah. That seemed like a cheat because you've, I was already through it, so I already knew where it was going to land. Ah, forget it. Clearly this is not regular spooky house of jump scares in case you couldn't figure it out by now. I mean, I don't know... I don't know what you're get, what's going to happen. I don't know if there's any hope for you if you still haven't figured it out. This isn't the real spooky house of jump scares, but... I mean, clearly I can't help you, but... In any case... Huh. Seems to be doing the same things over and over again. Oh, okay, here. Here we have something new. I know something is following me, but... I feel like I am prancing through the same rooms over and over, hopefully leaving notes. As bread comes, crumbs will prove I am making progress and reaching some destination. This is not romantic at all! I'm surprised it didn't have that in it. Oh boy. Is this where something is following me? That'd be funny if it was a Doom monster following me. <laughs> Seriously. That would be hilarious, like if it was a lost soul from Doom following you. That'd be kind of funny. In a weird way. Okay. That one already triggered. Oh, it's... Not attached to the wall, it's a sprite that's following me. Ink, not quite quenching my thirst. Taste is terrible, stains are terrible, I don't think drinking it was very, or it was a very romantic idea. This guy's obsessed with romance. What a freak. Nah, <laughs> nah I'm just kidding, I'm just messing around. Whoever, whoever this guy is, I'm sure he's okay. Or maybe that's the ghost girl, maybe she wants some romance. Nope, not even gonna think about that. Forget, forget I said that. I don't even know what the hell I was thinking when I said that. <coughs> Ooh, slime. Oh boy. Shouting, spouting, splashing, soaking, innards, ingest, invoking, nailing, never stops the choking. What? That looks like Enderman. Okay. Right, that's the creature from the actual spooky ass of jump scares. So, this this does actually happen. There is actually enough of this mod for that to actually happen. That's cool. Oh boy, come on. Let me just get out ahead of it. Come on, damn it. Okay, good thing I can save. Ah, oh, great. This is just what I needed. This is what everyone freaking needed. Oh, great. A tree. Oh, come on. It was. I was right next to the entrance, so of course I'm not gonna get away before it hits me at least once or twice. Are you kidding me? You can actually trap yourself while it's attacking you. I know what you have done and what you have yet to do, but it's all right because I'm inside you now. You are one, but I am many. What the hell? Oh crap. Just gotta keep running, running, sprinting. Yes, sprinting. Well, I'm walking now. Oh crap. I got myself locked in a corner. And worst of all, I saved it, which means there's no going back. What the hell? Is there just no way? 
Oh crap! What ways forward? Am I screwed? I don't understand this. It's locked! And the other one sends me to bars! So what way is there forward? I don't understand this. Crap. This isn't very good. Okay. I can only assume I'm I was going the right way. Kinda. Ah, uh, this sucks. This really sucks. Okay. Nope, go to the one on the left. Definitely the one on the left. The one on the right? Definitely. I told you it was the one on the right. Ah, this. This sucks. Come on. Oh, come on, you son of an ass monkey. Crap. This, this sucks. It's very hard to get anywhere. Come on. Hurry up and get out of its path. Get out of its path, not into its path. But there's nothing here. Is it just hopeless? Come on, there's got to be a way. There's got to be a freaking way. There's got to be a morning after. Where the hell am I going? I'm getting stuck along the sides. And I'm gonna die over and over again. Like Groundhog's Day. What the hell is going on with this place? It is enough to kill me in. I'm gonna die. Let's not say goodbye. Let's just say we're gonna die! Crap. Great, who would be ringing me at a time like this? Hello. Be quiet. Nobody asked you. Did they? Mysterious voice. Great. Fantastic! Crap. Hello? This... This is very unfortunate. This is a series of unfortunate events. For your viewing pleasure. What the hell? Is there no way through? Hello? You can shut your face. Okay. It is possible to get through. But only just. Yeesh. How much farther until it stops chasing me? Thanks. Thanks for that. Probably until I reach a hundred. That's probably when it'll stop because it changes every 50 rooms. It makes sense, right? Oh. Never mind. I didn't have to go the full hundred rooms for it to stop chasing me. Okay, good. I can take a little breather now. There's not even any more slime here. He gave up the chase! Great. Great. Not that that's very good for me. Look at me. <laughs> Poor Doom guy. He looks like he's seen better days. Uh, I just want to get over there. I just want to get out of this nightmare. That's what he's thinking. There's no hope for me. He looks sad in this state. I mean, if you think about it, you can actually sort of tell his his state of mind by looking at his HUD bar, the more he takes damage. I mean, when, when he's at 100% through 80%, he looks just fine. 79% through 61%, you know, he's got a nose bleeding. He's looking around, he's getting more cautious. And then I think it's 59% uh, through 40% is he, he looks angry. He looks very serious like he does now, and what it was before, he starts to look sad and depressed, and then even more so when he takes more damage between 19% and 1%, I 
And at zero percent, his head splits open and he just dies. Yes. Let me listen to this. Hello. I don't know if you tell I found something today to satisfy oh, my yes. romantic oh, thirst. Oh. I don't know I if you... I awoke today from a brief faint and found before you know what, let, let him talk. Okay. Hello? Hello? Yes. And found before Hello? me a bottle of red wine. I am not I sure what brand or year, uh, for there is yes. no Hello? label. All yes. I uh, gather is yes. that it tastes strongly metallic. Yes. Hi. Hello. Hello? Yes. Hello? Hello? Oh, uh, yes. Hello? Hi. Hello. Uh. Uh. We get it. You're the FNAF phone Hello. guy. Hi. I don't know if you want to look directly at... Hi. Hello. Okay, it, it's on repeat at this point. Thanks. Thanks for that. I don't think it was wine. Well, it had a metallic taste to it, so... It might have been paint. You just drank paint. Well done. He just scorfed up that paint. You may as well have huffed it. Seriously. Okay. Moving forward. I'm guess I don't think there's gonna be a thousand rooms. I don't think it's that uh expansive. I could be wrong. Okay, look. See this is what I was talking about. Now he's up to the the nose bleeding. He's looking around. He's he's a little more cautious. He doesn't look too concerned, but you know, he's a little more cautious. He's looking over his shoulder now. He's, he's squinting to look behind him more easily. Or to the side of him, I mean. He's unsure. He's trying to be more cautious so that he doesn't get hurt some more. He doesn't get snuck up on. Ah, I see. It's the same one over and over again. Yeah, like always. Let's see. So it should be right here. I was right. And with one more hit point. I don't know how much longer I can go on. I haven't seen any of my previous notes. So that means either I'm getting somewhere or someone is taking them. Oh, sorry. Was that me? Did I do that? Did I do that? Yeah, see there. Now he's back to normal. He's not even squinting. He's just looking around normal. Ah, it, nothing's wrong. Just looking around, you know, just making sure I'm aware of my surroundings somewhat. I'm in a fairly neutral mood here. We can do this. That's his, that's his expression. We can do this. That wasn't me talking. I was just ex explaining what kind of expression he has. Sorry if you thought that was coming from me. Because I don't think I can do this at all. What in the hell? Come on, just four more rooms and I'll get to a hundred. And I'm guessing it'll be another elevator. Yep. Another elevator. The rooms are changing ever so slightly. And of course, just like in the real game, it, they change ever so slightly. Just enough so that it kind of looks like they could have some variation. Okay. Cool. Cool. Nice slime room. Nice doomed slime room again. I think I'm gonna get out of this now. Nice. Cool. I think this is my last note. I'm going to die having never found my escape, but really that's not true. This place was like my escape, my escape from everything else. In the end, my death is kind of romantic. Who the hell is this guy? It's just weird. Yeah, whatever. Come on, click. There we go. Sounds like something is scraping against metal. It's probably a very old elevator. A very old and rusty note. Don't even think about it. Ah, oh, okay. It's still got some variety left in it. As evidenced by the fact that this appears to be a new room. Cool. This isn't a new room, though. I've seen this before. From both sides. Mm. Hooray! Getting lost. It's a specialty of mine. Even in a game as simplistic as this, I still somehow manage to get myself lost. Quite too easily. 
Hmm. Well, even if I backtrack, I'm still somehow going into new rooms. Which is kind of funny. If you think about it. I'm actually surprised it's going on this long. It may just surprise me and end up going on longer than I would have thought. I mean, considering the average size of a Doom map, this is pretty damn impressive, you gotta admit. Although most of it is because of the the inability to run very far. So that probably has something to do with it. And I'm guessing I've been on the other side of that too. Considering the map filled out for my beginning position up there. Which only I can only assume means that I was on the other side of that. Hence, one of those that you end up in a cage. So yeah, that's pretty clever showing you both sides of it. Making use of every single bit that you can. Hello, nice to see you too. I couldn't really care less about you, but hey, it's nice to see you. Look at that stack of skeletons again. Ooh, and that minced person. Feel sorry for him. I wouldn't want to be that guy right about now. Another one of these? Okay, I'll take the left side. I just want to... Let's inject some variety into it this time. Okay, another one of these. Over the catwalk. Down by the sea, yeah. On a blanket with my monsters. Okay. All of a sudden, my footsteps are a lot louder. There, there are creatures in this one. I think I remember that. There are creatures up in here. I smell them. Yep. That, that mud creature thing. Ooh, a red key. Nice. That's pretty funny. Okay. Subject 5 is growing more and more restless. I told Spook we need more funds for sedatives, but she just laughed and flew into the ceiling. Without more chemicals to keep these things docile, I'm not sure how much longer we can keep them here safely. Generic lab assistant. Fantastic. That's just to set you up for the danger ahead. So I'd better run. I'd better go through here as quickly as possible. I believe Project 5 is loose. The glass around its container is shattered and I can faintly hear clicking coming from the ceiling. I don't know what will happen now. If it is out and alive, then this is probably my last report. The clicking is getting louder now. Oh, okay. Fantastic. Great. Great. Gotta run. Whoop, got a blast. Wow. The worst possible time to stick me in this one. Yeesh. Okay, cool. I better keep saving periodically. That's the only thing keeping me safe. Uh, okay. Did it just go under the floor? Can it do that? Can it go through the floor to get to me? Oh boy. Go around it. <laughs> there we go. Let's keep going. I crawl through hell. This shouldn't kill me. I shouldn't. I better not die to something this pathetic. I have crawled through the depths of hell because they killed my rabbit. If I die to this, that would just be embarrassing. Oh boy. Well, it wasn't the mud monster, it's just some spider things. Oh. Okay. Can they not... Can they not chase me anymore? Did they, did they legitimately fall through it? Was that a glitch and it wasn't supposed to happen? I'm going to assume that was a glitch and it wasn't supposed to happen. Hey, Mod Maker, you got a glitch there. They kind of go through the catwalk if they go onto the sides of it. Just saying. I'm not sure if that's intentional, but it seems like a glitch to me, so... I'm just going to point it out here. Okay, that's that's nice for you. I got to keep running. Oh, boy. Oh, crap. Yeah, those traps don't seem so cute anymore once they actually get me killed. I gotta be able to run. Gotta be able to keep sprinting. Come on, damn it. Can't you tell that I'm about to die? Don't you even care? 
Do you have to have a conscience? Okay, so far so good. Crap. Crap. I cannot afford to make those kind of mistakes. Well, okay, I kind of can. I kind of can. But at the same time, not really. I can't afford to make too many mistakes. Better get away from the spiders of hell. Like I said, I still think it would be kind of funny if I was attacked by a doom monster. Okay, that's the one where the solution is on the left this time. Just gotta go this way. I bet everything that it is this way. I am certain. Yeah, because the the variation, it doesn't really change because by its nature it couldn't because of the Doom mod. So, once you've been to a room once, you pretty much know its layout. You pretty much know its tricks. Unless they can change some variables on it, but the, I don't think they're going to change the layout of the floor. They haven't so far. That, that would actually be cool if they used lifts to do that, to, to change the layout. Oh, come on, you son of an ass monkey. Son of an ass monkey? I don't even know what the hell an ass monkey would be. You monkey's uncle. You monkey scrotum. Whatever the hell. You douche. Okay, I'm at 143. That means... Okay. Wait, did, did it just skip it? It skipped it. Okay. That's cool. Oh. No note this time. That's not a good sign. Okay. That's cool. <laughs> More of the scraping sound again. Do 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 do. Always good for a laugh, huh? Yeesh, this mod is actually a lot longer than I gave it credit for. Many, many props to the Doom modder. I didn't think this was possible. I mean, I know they're pretty much just repeating rooms, but... You know, that's the way it was in the original, so we can get away with it. It makes sense now. That's how he, he, he or she or whoever made this was able to do this, because it follows the spooky rules, which means it can just repeat the same space over and over again to save space. That way it doesn't matter that Doom has a limited size area that you can make the maps, even in Doom Builder. Because... Oh, okay. Hello again. Good to see you. Haven't seen you in a while. I was too busy running away from creatures that were actually trying to kill me, instead of you just hanging there. I like you. You just hang. You're just chilling out. You're just trying to say hello in your freaky way. Oh, hey. Hi to you too. You guys are cool. I like you. You don't chase me. Down in the hallway. Hi! Pumpkin. It's a little... Mmm. Butter toast. Butter toast. Oh, hello. There are two of them now. I wonder if that's symbolic of something. I wonder what that desk is for. Oh, well. I mean, cabinet. Whatever. Probably desk. Uh, okay. Is something else gonna chase after me? I get the feeling that it is. Huh. I just happened to pick the right one. First try. That was a lucky guess. Or a very fortunate guess. I'm very blessed. This isn't just luck. It's fortune. It's good fortune. Someone up there is... Helping me, I guess. <laughs> okay. Even more. Okay, I think I'm going to skip it now. I'll let you know if something new happens. Be right back. Oh, wait. Yeah. Little did I say that. Something new already happens. Yeesh. Must be several freaking dynamic lights. I think the, the game is actually slowing down a little bit. Huh. 
Interesting. A lot of notes. But I can't read any of them. Oh, that's in Japanese. Who reads Japanese? Tell me what this says. Now. I'm pretty sure it has some kind of symbolic meaning behind it. Oh yeah, I think there's a ghost here that chases you. So, that's something. <laughs> right? What the? Oh, okay. That's cool. That's, this is a weird looking flashlight. I mean, I know the the modder did the best he could. The best he could. Under the circumstances, considering it's just a Doom mod, but still, it looks kind of weird. Especially the way that the models are full bright when you put it into it. Because Doom, GZ Doom doesn't really have oh. dynamic shadows for the models, which I always found as kind of a, an annoying limitation, but hey. I'm sure there might be some reason for it. Could it really be true? I... I taught... I thought the fairy tales about the ghost that eats children who sneak in after class was just to keep us from disobeying, but... Metsuri is still missing. Yep, this is to... This is to introduce me to the freaking ghost that's going to be chasing me. And in the dark. So that's gonna be even better. Good times for all. With this awkward as hell flashlight. Oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna survive this. I definitely feel good about my chances. Let me tell you about it. I'm just so optimistic. Oh crap. Great. Was that the ghost? Yep. Oh wait, those are just the spiders from earlier. Oh, holy crap, that was close. Good. Oh. Now she's in she's in the midst of those spiders. <laughs> it's a good thing I got out of the classroom at least. Because at least I can see where I'm going. And I got trapped. I don't want to risk it. Oh, okay. Cool. I guess she got stuck herself. Oh, crap. She can go through the slime. That's not good for me. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Spooky house. Screw whatever joke I put in there before. I ain't got time for this. Time to keep running. Running. Right. It's that stupid maze again. It keeps putting me into it. But with a new enemy at the forefront. Oh, okay. Good thing I figured out pretty fast where I'm supposed to go. That's cute. Let's call it cute. <laughs> uh. Oh, there's the right way. Gotta love the pleasant sounding music that is playing to my death. I guess that's from her point of view. In her point of view, she's having a ball. She's like, oh, I can't wait to devour this young morsel. I'm having the time of my life. That's what she's thinking. Hello. Shut up. Shut up. Yes, shut up. Shut up, shut up. We get it. You're the FNAF phone guy. We get it. Shut up. Shut up, shut up. Uh, I'm just being snarky now. Oh, crap. Yep, it's the one on the left. No. I don't wanna. I don't feel like it. You can't make me. You're not gonna make me, foul beast from Hades! Foul beast from hell. I don't know if this, this was the right choice or not. Going on good faith that it is. Crap. Oh, this isn't good. This isn't good at all. Oh, crap. I think it's this way. 
I haven't gotten to a dead end yet, so I can only assume that that means that this is the right way. And I couldn't help but get hit in the face, too, while this was happening. Nope! I'm good, I'm perfectly good, thank you. You can't make me. Oh, son of a... Son of a mother! And it's the same no matter what path you choose. Get away from me! Get away! I'm not going with you! I'm not! Help me! Please! Where the hell is the... Where the hell is the solution? Okay. Hush now, child. Hush now, my child. You're safe now. Cute. And the funny thing is it's... It doesn't clash well with the fact that the Doom Death mechanic has you on the ground and the widescreen effect kind of hurts it a small bit. Just a small bit. Oh yeah. It's on that... It's in that corner. You should have realized. Don't worry. I've kind of already been born. I don't need to be birthed again. I don't want to be birthed again. Once is enough. So please, stay far away from me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get a cease and desist against your ass if you don't get, if you don't step up right now. You know what? You stay here. I'll go and get help. Quick, stay there. I'll, I'll go and get help. Don't worry. I'll find someone. I don't know. I'll find some embryo on the street, and we can shove that in there. You can. Nurse it to full. Crap. Yep. It was inevitable. Okay. Why? Why would you do that to me? You suck. Okay, 199. This is the... This, is, this should be the last room before I get to the elevator. Yep, this is the last room before I get to the elevator. This is surprisingly deep. I, it might actually be long enough to get to the axe weapon. I'm, I'm not sure about that. But I suppose I will find out. Kind of weird how each door on each level just looks like a wall that you can somehow slam your way through. Unless this is just how the door the doors just happen to look like tiles in... Spooky house of jump scares. Or maybe that was just an oversight on the dev part. Oh, who knows? Who's to say, really? I took a beating from that ghost, though. I mean, look at me. Okay, it's just a nosebleed. But dirt toast. Good to meet you, too. Good to meet you, too. Oh, crap. Right, this is the slime again. On. It rubs the lotion on the skin. Is that what's going on here? Ah, okay. Nice old normalcy. And something new. Something old, something new, something blue, and something stew. Ah, okay. It is changing variables on me. Huh. Cool. Neat. What's gonna chase after me next? That Frankenstein monster? Actually, I think there was one area in the original spooky house. I don't remember this. I would have remembered this. I don't even remember this from the original spooky house of jump scares. Then again, that's probably because I just don't remember it. I'm sure it was in there somewhere. I just don't remember it. This kind of sucks. Get stuck a lot. Okay. Am I crawling towards the light? Should I should I be crawling towards the light? Ah, I look like I was dead. Oh great. Now there's something chasing after me. 
Do they have the capacity to chase after me? Was it locked in a cage? Where it can't hurt me. Ah, this is the hellish part. Well, I'm Doom Guy. I've been through hell before. What do you think this is? It actually looks like I'm going through some of the testing, which is just disgusting. <laughs> don't tell me I'm not don't tell me I'm the only one who thought of that. Looks like I'm going through a freaking intestine. Well, this game's gone to crap. <laughs> Literally. You get it? Oh crap. Uh, damn. Damn, damn, damn. Damn, damn, damn! I'm like... Crap, what's that baby's name? Bam Bam? His name is now Damn Damn. Damn, damn, damn! Damn, damn, damn! Let me see what kind of death this is. Oh, that's it? Just a game over? Your soul enters a one... Your soul wanders an endless maze. Okay, that's... That was a bit generic, don't you think? So... He does slightly more damage than the previous monsters. Either that, or... He somehow ignores frame vul invulnerability. Great, this... this again. At least now I remember straight off the bat that it's in the... upper left. Oh, okay. On the plus side, he was probably following me, so that didn't really hurt my progress at all. And when you remember where things are, it makes it easier for you to get away. Yep. I freaking knew it. Oh, crap. Uh, <laughs> uh, yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. That is legitimately jumpy. While you're being chased, and you're trying not to get killed, those... Suddenly that loud noise and... Image popping up in front of you while you're trying to get away is... Somewhat of a shaker. It, that actually made me shake. That actually made my skin shake there for a second. So, bravo, game! Although that's not... That's not from the mod. That's just from the original game. So, good work, Spooky. And good work, do mod for so faithfully recreating that. I'm sure it would have it wouldn't have been the same without it. At least you get like a a second of reprieve before it actually starts getting through the door. That way you actually have a chance to get away from it if if you're right up against the door and have no way. Great, this again. I believe it is the third one down. I believe so. I think that's how it goes. Nope, fourth one down. Ree! 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 Wow, really? Okay, you changed it up on me, game. Well done. Really? That's still not it, huh? Well, you're clever, aren't you? Clever girl. Still not. This isn't it either. Nope. Yeah, it is. When I start guessing that it's not, that's when it decides to do it. That is clever. We get it. Pig slaughter. And we get it. Trap. Man, good thing they get lost pretty easily. Otherwise, that would have been a trap. Surely. Yeesh. Disturbing little noises, ain't it? Okay. I only have to do this until I get to 250. Apparently it's always on the left. I thought it might switch things around on me. Nope! Should've known it's gonna be the same thing over and over again. Like Groundhog Day. Groundhog's Day. Yes, we get it. Ooh, very scary. Yeesh. That legitimately scared me because it's trying to get me stuck and get me killed. That's legitimately, that's far more terrifying than the jump scare itself. The 
fact that it's now going out of its way to try to kill me. Why do I keep falling for that? You think I would have figured it out by now? But nope. I keep falling for it. And the game is more than happy to make fun of me for it. Oh, okay, good. That was a very fortunate guess. Okay, it's over. Wait. Sam, you made it this far. It's a... Uh, that's great. I shall grant you a gift for your progress. So, uh, so just keep going. Thanks. Look behind you. Okay, that's cool. Thanks. What a great gift. Well, at least I got a save point. Not that it matters because this is a Doom mod. Huh. Yeesh. I'm starting to think this might actually last two through a thousand rooms. Who wants to see me do another one of these? Because I'm, I'm definitely gonna, not going to do all of them in one episode, that's for sure. I'll be lucky if I get to 300 in one episode. Spooky's House 300. <laughs> Where the Spartans try their best to kill the the beast. Ah, <laughs> uh, good stuff. Good thing I wasn't being chased by anything or else I would have been deader than dead. Deader than Elvis. I would have been deader than Elvis. Okie dokie. This is all fine and dandy, but... What else is gonna happen? Okay, gonna let you know when anything actually happens. Be right back. Hello again. Hello, spider. Nice web, Mr. Crack Spider. And to you too, ice cream. I wish I had some ice cream right now. And some coffee. Because that, there was a cup of coffee that jump scared me a few minutes ago. Better yet, coffee flavored ice cream. I could use some of that right now. Uh, yes. Yes, hi. Hello. Hello. If I ignore it, maybe it'll go away. <laughs> well, I am sad to report that there doesn't appear to have been anything new in that room. Well, in that sequence up to now. Well, I made it to 300, so that's something, right? If anyone wants to see me go through the rest of these just to see what happens next, I'm actually kind of curious to see if you do actually get the axe. You might actually do it. It might actually extend that far, who knows? But anyway, I think I'm just going to end this here. So, that's it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like corpses and torches. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day.